Nobody ever leaves us messages anymore. One of these days we're gonna finish that game. I'm still working on getting the rest of the darts from the police impound. Life troubling your digestion? Reality blocking your passages? Expel your troubles with Emetics, the handbook for multicolored happiness, and separate your bliss. Hey, that's that personal color spectrum book. Self-help for the helplessly selfish. Perfect! I'll take two. I bought that VCR at the supermarket. So you know it's a good one. Still smells like asparagus, though. No comment. 20 years worth of electric bills take up a surprising amount of space. Yoo-hoo, tiny hoodlums. Leave the cheese by the hole. Aha. Oh, there it is. Unfortunately, this is not Swiss cheese. So what? So, the rat was very specific about wanting Swiss cheese in particular. No comment. Take that, you law-breaking dairy products! Sam, no! The cheese was innocent! Innocent? I think not. Voila! Swiss cheese! Or close enough to fool the casual observer, anyway. Don't say voila! Yoo-hoo! Time- Leave the cheat. Greetings! The members of the Benevolent Brotherhood of Vermin would like to thank you for your offering. The members of Sam and Max would like their phone back now. If you don't mind. I regret to inform you the situation has changed, and I am unable to comply with your request. A list of additional demands for the return of the phone is as follows. Now, let's discuss this calmly. Let's debone the smarmy little skis and see if the phone's in there. I ain't talking, coppers. Jimmy Two Teeth ain't no rat. Uh, well, I ain't talking. Look, I want to help you, but my partner is a little unhinged. I'm afraid I may be unable to keep him from harming you in some colorfully gruesome fashion. Let me at him, Sam! Eh, I can take care of myself. Maybe you'd like it if we played you some music. How about Cat Stevens? Fine. Jimmy Two Teeth ain't afraid of no cats. Hey, Dogface, your partner's giving me a headache. Let me pry open his skull and look for a conscience, Sam. Yeah, yeah, I'm shaking like bacon here. Can I go now? I'm about ready to wring your scrawny, trash-eating neck. You think you're scary? You don't know where his hands have been. Or when I last washed them. Who cares? I'm a rat, remember? Amateurs. We'll go half easy on you if you'll just cough up the phone. Yeah, yeah. Never happened, pig. You mentioned a headache. Would you like some aspirin? Oh, and while I'm at it, is there anything else I can do to make you comfortable? Are you thirsty, perhaps? Light's too bright? Well, that's sporting of you. Now you mention it, I really don't like being up here so high. I got me a thing about heights. They make me nervous, you know? Oh, really? Don't like heights, eh? How'd you like it if I dangled your greasy hide out the window? Hey, you wouldn't. Wait! I warn you, I'm known for my fuzzy white butterfingers. It's true. You should see him trying to tie an ascot. All right, all right! Have mercy! I've had mercy. It was unpleasantly gooey, like, well, like things that have fallen onto pavement from a great height. I give up! Take your phone and let me go! Ah, oh, for the love of... I wish I could unsee that. Hello. Yes? Great gouts of steaming magma on a beeline for the orphanage. We're on our way. Yeah! Ow! 
Where's the rat? I let him go. Who was on the phone? It was a commissioner, Max. Multiple reports of malfeasance in the neighborhood. Oh, joy! That's my second favorite feasance! Idiot. We've got to get down to the corner store right away. Say there, unfashionably dressed street urchin. Oh, you made me mess up. Now I have to start all over. Yowzers, you are one ugly kid. Hey. Oh, that's right. You're one of the lovable scamps from that old TV show about the singing soda jerks. It's called the Soda Poppers, and the 70s are not old. Specs, it's you! Wow, an actual celebrity vandalizing our neighborhood. This is great! By the way, we're freelance police, and you're under arrest. No, I've really got to finish this. But thanks anyway. Um... Seriously, you're under arrest. Come along quietly and no one gets hurt. Actually, I prefer that you don't come quietly. Must... finish... painting... Excuse us, we've got important things to do. Don't we all? Max, you've got the TV schedule memorized. Weren't the soda poppers going to be featured on one of those grim celebrity tell-alls today? Oh yeah, on channel 173, the Child Star Exposé Network, which we only get when it's convenient. Have no fear, simple citizens. The freelance police are here to keep the peace. Violently, if possible, you called. It's just you two? Where's the SWAT team? Where's the National Guard? Where's NASA? NASA? Hold on, Bosco. What's the problem? What's the problem? It's a terrorist! A munchkin terrorist! He'll be the death of us all! Where is this Lilliputian agitator? Are you blind? He's right there! Hey, it's another one of the soda poppers! Isn't he the one with the ladder control issues? Yeah, Wizard! He's a former child star? Poe, oh, just lock him up and throw away the jail! Exactly what is the nature of Wizard's malfeasance? He's delivering videos I didn't even order! Brady Culture's Ibo? What is that? Oh, it's something bad, I can tell you that. Videos. And look at that display. It's subversive and hideous. I don't know any white guy with a fro like that. I hear that. Any idea why a freakish relic of the 70s would unload videos in your store? Think about it. No individual acting alone would ever deliver videos of his own volition. <laughs> it makes no sense. I smell a conspiracy. I think you're just catching the hot weenies in an updraft. <laughs> No, it's definitely a conspiracy. What sort of malevolent forces would conspire to burden you with un- Oh, they've- Stop right there! Oh, sure. I think we got it. Okay, anything else? We'll chat more later, Bosco, but right now it's time to get up close and personal with that pint-sized evildoer. Stop that- Hey there, Mr. Wizard. No need to be formal. My friends just call me Wizard. And so do my enemies and lots of people like you I've never met. Everyone calls me Wizard. What exactly are you doing here? Delivering videos. Take one. They're free. Are you aware that you're breaking the law? Come on, guys. There's no law against giving away free stuff. Unlawful deliveries are punishable under Section 9, Article 7, Title 11 of the Personal, Private, Public, Professional Conduct Penal Code. You made that up. True, but we could write him up for littering, trespassing, and disturbing the peace. I have to deliver these videos. Boy, what a monotonoid. Can we arrest him now? In a minute, little buddy. My cousin's wife's dentist loved your show. Oh, yeah. We've always been a big hit with the dentists. 
Gee, I wonder why. Hey, kids, guzzle soda like the soda poppers, and you'll need so much expensive dental work, you can kiss college goodbye. Max, your unbridled cynicism is like a breath of fresh air on a crowded subway. Any chance we could get you to sing the song from your old show? Yeah, the theme song. What was it called? It was called More Than Jerks. But I can't sing it. I'm too embarrassed. Come on, sing the Soda Popper theme song. No, I don't think so. What'll it take to get you to sing that song? We'll be your best friends. No. Are you sure you won't sing the Soda Popper song? I won't gnaw your leg off if you do it. No. Come on, sing the Soda Popper song. Pretty please. No. Come on, sing the Soda Popper song. Ugly please. No. Come on. I promise not to. No. Come on. No. Come on. We're little peepers, specks, and whizzer. Toiling out the soda works. Guzzling with tiny gizzards. Soda fountain special perks. Then they run like human blizzards. More than simple soda jerks. Soda poppers more than jerks! Wow, I feel all clam chowdery inside. Well, that's nice. What is? If you'll take a...